Hi everyone! Happy International Earth Day! Today is Wednesday, April 22nd, and that means it is the day that we take care and appreciate the planet we live in. I'm so excited to be with you guys in this special day, even though we're not together, but we can celebrate doing our craft for today. So, how are we going to start our work? What we're going to need is a white cardboard or a thick paper. I'm going to need some beans, lentils, or coffee uh, beans, okay? I'm going to need at least two, two of these, a light color and a dark color. That will work really good, okay? I'm also going to need a pair of scissors, a pencil, and some glue. For starters, what I'm going to do with my paper is I'm going to fold it in half. Just like this. There we go. So, what we're going to do is we're going to draw a nice flower. Let me see if I can fix the angle a little bit. There we go. Okay, we're gonna draw a flower, okay? I want the flower to be big. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a big circle. Okay, I'm gonna do a big petal. One, two, three, four, Five, and we can do a number six. Okay, then I'm gonna do its leaves. So I have my flower, and now what am I gonna do? I'm gonna grab my glue, and I want you to pay attention on how I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna zoom this a little bit so you can pay attention. Okay, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna put a thick layer of glue, just like that. Can you see how the border is and how the glue is? Now I'm gonna do my coffee beans, okay? I'm gonna do coffee beans, and I'm gonna start going around my drawing. Do it with patience, do it nice and, and even, so your work will look really nice. If you need more glue, you can put some more. Let's see, over here I'm missing a little bit of glue. So, I'm running out of glue. Okay, there we go. Just like that, okay? Then I'm gonna continue with my second row. There we go.
this is a nice project if you want to give somebody a nice gift. I would certainly enjoy something like this. My kids would do it for me. So that's my first petal. Now I'm going to start working with the second one. second petal over here. There is my second petal. Now we're gonna do our third one. I'm gonna put some of my glue that fell on my table. There we go. Be careful to not um, get glue out of your area. That way your work is not gonna have any um, glue, glue um, stains here. Try doing it also nice and even. See how I'm working? I'm going on my lines. I'm following a line. So that way it looks, um, it looks clean. The, the work looks clean and it's organized, okay? Here we go, almost done. So basically, that's how we have to work our petals, okay? So now we're gonna go all around to the center of our flower. And what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna use a contrasting color, okay? I'm gonna start using lentils that are lighter colored I can't believe today is Earth Day. 
please, please today, especially today, love your animals, take care of your plants, breathe fresh air, and think about what you can do to make our planet a better place to live. It's so important to be thankful for what we have. Sometimes day after day, we just go by and don't even notice what we have. But it's amazing, really, what, what us as human beings have been gifted with. We have beautiful um, views. We have air that we breathe in. We have beautiful animals. So please uh, make some time to think about what you can do to make our planet every time beautiful, more beautiful, how we can take care of our environment. Remember, you can turn off the lights when you're not using the light. When you get out of the room, you can turn off the light. If you're not watching TV, turn it off. If, uh, I don't know, you're brushing your teeth and water is running, please turn it off. You can use a cup, a water cup, to brush your teeth. That way you, you only use the amount that you really, really need. Also, uh, what else? Um, when you're walking, when you have to go somewhere, it's really close, tell, tell your dad, Mom, Dad, I want to go walking instead of going in my car. Or why don't we ride a bike? That helps our environment so much because there's so many cars that we use and all the contamination. It's a lot. A lot of people, a lot of smoke are coming out of our cars. So if it's really close, we can have a nice day walking. And it's also healthy making, doing exercise. So it's good for you, good for the environment. Take care of your animals, your dogs, your cats. Love them a lot. I'm almost done with this. There we go, we're almost, almost done. Ah, it's kind of moving a little bit. You know, the pieces are so small and my my fingers are with glue, so they glue together, they stick together my fingers. But it's a fun project, it's relaxing, it takes you time. Patience, something that you have to learn. Everything that's do with art is with patience. Concentrating, having fun doing it. Okay, so that's how it has to look. Now let me zoom this out a little bit. So this is how my flower is looking, okay? So now what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start working on the branches and my leaves. Okay, I'm gonna use again the dark color that's my coffee, my coffee beans, and I'm gonna just put this here. There we go. And now my leaves. There's one.
Let me get a small one here so it fits right there. So I have my leaves. I'm just going to fill this up a little bit more. Just filling the white spaces up. There we go. So at the end, I'm going to finish gluing all of these parts. All the way through. And I'm going to finish my flower. As you can see over here, let me side this a little bit here. This is my final work. This is how it's supposed to look like. See, I did a darker color here. I did a little bit brownish here, but it doesn't matter. It's whatever you guys have at home, so it's not complicated. I know it's really complicated to look for materials in uh, this quarantine, but um, do, do it with whatever seeds you have, okay? Just have fun doing it, relax, be patient with it, and love your planet okay hugs and kisses for everybody until next week bye bye for now bye bye